oh man, Mandy, this this mansion is great. And look how big this pool is. Yeah, I know. It was really expensive, though. But hey, it was worth it. Yeah. Wait. How come you decide to wear shoes and your tie at the pool? Hey, I mean, I, I, you're wearing gloves, too. I, I'm not the one to judge. Hmm. Good point. Hey, Bendy. Hey, Edgar. I brought the stuff that you wanted. All right, cool. Just put it over there. Okay. But, um, where's Alice? I don't know. Usually she, she's always with me. But I don't know where she is at the moment. Huh. That's weird. Hmm. <sighs> I can't believe the landlord kicked me out of my house. What am I going to do? Maybe I should move in with Bendy. Yeah. That was a really nice swim. I know, right? Huh. Oh, wait. Someone's at the door. I'll get it. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> hey, Bendy. Holy cow. Alice. Wow. Nice outfit. Thanks. Um, so, uh, what you doing here? Oh, Bendy, you got kicked out of my house. Oh, gee, really? How'd that happen? I haven't been paying my bills. Oh, dang, I knew I should have helped you out. Okay, uh, well, you want to stay here? Sure. Alright, follow me. Bendy and the Ink Machine. Mm hmm, mm hmm, in a way you've never seen. Oh, yeah, Benedy. Um, Alice needs to needs to stay here because uh, she got kicked out of her house, you know, because he, you know, bills and taxes and stuff, you know how it goes. Oh yeah, I've been there before. Well, do we have any empty rooms? Oh uh, yeah, there's one over there. All right. Hey. <sighs> Well, dinner was good. Yeah. Hey, uh, Boris, have you seen my, have you seen my toothpick? Uh, oh, which one was it again? Uh, the one that I keep on my bed. Oh, uh, I think you might have put it in the vault. Hmm, let me go check. Okay. If I did put it in the vault, why would I put it in? Boris! Alice! Edgar! Get in here! Yeah, Bendy? Yeah? Alright, guys. I know one of you did it. So just give it back. Um, what do you mean? What I mean... Okay, dang it, sorry. That's uh, Boris's voice. What I mean is, someone stole my $50 million that was in the vault. Now, just give it back, or else... Before I lose my mind. Well, Bendy, I don't have it. Yeah, me neither. Yeah, and I was I was somewhere else the whole time. <sighs> well, I'm going to figure this out. One way or another. Uh-oh. Alright, I'm ready. Uh, Bendy, why does your detective hat have Pikachu ears? Oh, well... I got this from the movie, uh, Detective Pikachu, and I just, I, I guess it just came with this. Oh. Alright. Now, I know when you did it, so I'm gonna get to the bottom of this. Uh. <sighs> Didn't know what to do. The fact that I knew, I knew my friends for so long, and the fact that they take my $50 million dollars, the betrayal hurt so bad, but I didn't know who it exactly was. Was it Boris? My friend that I knew for so long that could end up being jealous about my, my money. Was it Alice? My girlfriend who just recently lost her house and could be desperate for money? Or was it Edgar, an original member of the Butcher Gang that I just befriended because we, we escaped from prison together? A blur. I didn't know 
what who it could be. Oh, Bendy, what are you doing? I'm uh, doing that cool thing that detectives do. You know, everything's black and white, and they talk to themselves for some reason. Oh, oh, who do you think it could be? I don't know. But Boris, I need to talk to you. Okay. So, Boris, where were you when I was at the vault? Uh, I was at the dining table. I mean, you saw me. Hmm, good point. But, you did tell me that my toothpick was in the vault. How would you know that unless you were in the vault? No, 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 Bendy. I said, I think it might be in the vault. I didn't say I knew it was at the vault. And plus, why would I, why would I tell you to go someplace where, where you know that the money would be stolen and you would have suspected me? Does that make any sense? Good point. Although I kind of lost track of what you said. But... Still, good point. Alright, you can go. Thanks. I was still stumped. Didn't know. Alright, it wasn't Boris. But I still didn't know who exactly it was. Hmm. Maybe I should look closer to Alice. Maybe she's still. Alice. Mind to tell me where you were these past few minutes while I was at the vault? I was still at the dinner table. Dang it, crap. Same thing Boris said. Okay, gotta think. I gotta think of the right things to say. Okay, fine. Alice, I know you might have done it because you just lost your house and you're desperate for money. But instead of taking a few bills, you took my entire cash stack. Do you mind explaining why? I didn't do it. Ah, oh, good argument. Or maybe I'm just really bad at this type of stuff. Okay. Ah. Hmm. I got nothing. You can go. Alright. Went to my fi third and final suspect. Edgar. Edgar, I know you might have done it because you're still with the butcher gang. And you might go back to your criminal ways. Is this true? Uh, no. I promise, Bendy. I didn't do it. Hmm. Are you sure? Yeah. Alright, Pinky promise. What? Pinky promise. Okay. Alright. You can go. Alright. To go back to the scene of the crime for answers. And that's when I found something. Hmm, a bow tie. And it doesn't look like mine. Or, <gasps> I just thought of something. And that's when it hit me, right upside the head. Then, I called a meeting. Alright guys, I think I found out who did it. Alice. Me? Yep, that's right. And here's how I know. See, I think you are lying about the fact that you didn't steal anything. Because I know for a fact that all, that all people that are poor always want to have money. And I found out the truth from this. It's your bow tie. But, um, I'm wearing it. Aha, but that's the thing. This is the one from your back. You know, for the past few videos, I've noticed that you've always worn a bow tie on your back. The perfect crime. So tell the truth, and the truth shall set you free. Um, alright, I get it. <gasps> I knew it. The betrayal. And the truth shall set you free. Well, are you mad? Not really. I mean, I suspected this to happen. But, uh... I completely forgot what I was going to say. Well, that's all, folks.